Oh, hi there. Um, this man is Oscar. Hi, and this thing is Mono. And this thing wants to like make a definitive list or something. I mean, of you know. the top 100 music videos of all time. And this thing, what's the name of the podcast? Oh, it's Podcast Killed the Video Star Thing 2. <laughs> uh, we are Thing 1, the, Thing 2, absolutely. That part, we are 100%. That. Yeah, yeah. And the real thing is, you get to say too. Yes. Right? yes, yes, yes. Welcome to another edition oh. of Podcast Killed the Video Star. Music. So with, how many music videos do you think we've uh, talked about in, in our journey? Let's see. This is like 54, 54. times 3. Can like, maybe Lelon can maybe Lelon can do that. So, uh it's over 150, I'll tell you that much. Oh my it's, god. Yeah. Um so Oh, I'm supposed talked... to do some multiplication table. What was it? Um no, I was just trying to figure out what how many music videos we've Okay, maybe, give maybe me the done. give me the equation. 54 times 3. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Uh, that, that 162. That what? Woo! I think you know so. what's weird that I know it is, and the only way I know it is because I literally, I literally put three fifties and three fours. Like oh, that's, that's smart. That's that's common core. There we go, common core. Hey, hey. is that? Hey, well, core? the genius. We'll I don't know, <laughs> but what I do know is that the lovely tone that you're hearing is that of our amazing guest, actor, comedian, improviser, dear friend. Leelon Bowden. Woo! Oh, hello, Mono and Oscar. Hi, Leelon. This is so fun. Oh. I don't ever get to see <laughs> you guys enough. I know. I know. I know but it's never enough. I'm glad that we're all here, and I'm glad we're talking music videos. Now, Leelon, what's the deal with music videos? Are you a fan of them? Uh, were, were you part of the MTV generation growing up, the TRL crowd? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, now, like, I'm just, like, very shoulder shrug, you know, like, <laughs> because music videos just became Spotify and no videos. Unless it's, like, something like, oh, you have to check out Childish Gambino's This Is America. You know, then, like, then it's, like, right. okay, if it's, like, if it's newsworthy, then I'll watch it, you know, but, like, um, you know, like, it's, we, we don't really have the, the setup for it, whereas I feel like the MTV right. TRL time, that was, like, we weren't, right. they, there wasn't a setup to watch anything else. But music videos. That's a good point. Right. You know what I mean? Like, so of course I did. <laughs> it was all of TV, whereas now it's kind of you have to seek it or you have to literally like be like, see someone tweet about it and be like, holy shit. And like, that's what brings you to the music video as opposed to it being on. Right. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's so funny because yeah. like gone are the days where we look at music videos for inspiration in terms of our outfits, our styles, what's cool, what mm -hmm. isn't. You know right. what I mean? Because yeah. that really told us what was in. You know, Madonna in the 80s, like very much part of the MTV generation, was the whole like, like a virgin aesthetic was because of her music video, Like right. a Virgin. Do you yes. know what I mean? Yes, absolutely. We look to we look to these videos for like who what is cool. And and like for me, I wasn't the time at the time I was watching MTV's TRL, like I was not necessarily confident in my coolness. <laughs> and so I was like, oh good, answers. Like I <laughs> like it was a direct <laughs> it, it wasn't just like a subconscious like flow in my head of being like hmm now i want to wear jinko jeans or whatever it was oh my god it was Answers like is so funny you know absolutely uh, that might have to be the name of this and episode. i was just thinking the same thing <laughs> answers exclamation point <laughs> answers with leelon <laughs> bowden you're so right though where it's like now music videos are so much like this is already a cool curated i mean they literally have like the best designer yeah they have the product placement it is a curated product um, and like before it was just like people throwing darts at the board and being like, I don't know, let's try yeah, this. Figuring it out. That was mm -hmm. more fun to me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Like, I feel like now people who were our age, who are our, our age, when we watched TRL, they, they're at TikTok for answers. That's where the answers uh, that's are. That's absolutely true. Yep. Absolutely and TikTok true. has yeah. all the answers. Yes. And I know this, and I'm not even on TikTok. 
Oh, I know. Well, I get my TikTok stuff through Instagram. Insta. Like Insta will sort of filter yeah, out all that stuff. We're millennials. That's how. Absolutely. Yeah. You know, that's yeah. how we do it. We're like. We're in our yep. old. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Like, Same. This is the version of like our parents asking us like, why is, why are all these people in my feed on Facebook? And, they're, and we're like, no, <laughs> yeah. mom, they're not in your feed. That's just who you follow. It's like, they're like, I don't want them in my feed. And it's like, well, then don't follow them. It's like, well, I have to. They're your aunt. <laughs> Or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> when I see, I really, I am exactly the same. And because when I see like the video on Instagram, but it already has the TikTok badge on it, yeah. I feel like an alien who like accidentally caught a broadcast, like floating <laughs> out in space. Like I'm like, I I've somehow come across this. And also it's just like, it's a little defeating, you know, like yeah. it's yeah. just like, oh, I guess right now all we're doing is smiling while a music song plays and pointing to different parts of the screen. Oh pop up. my God. And it's just hey, like, oh, that. I'm never going to, I'm never going to like pop in on that. I wasn't on top of it. And, and these things are like, you know, like surfing waves. It's like, I'm not going to catch that one. Yeah, I'm not gonna like. There's so many of them. I just Awful. I'm just waving by to because I'm like, no, like I'm never gonna, I'm never gonna make a video where I'm smiling and like vibing to some Awful. music while pointing to different corners. Ew, of my I hate the like gung gung bum 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 bum. I hate that. <laughs> That one uh, makes me want to throw up. Who knew this podcast was going to be secretly cranky old millennials? I know. We sound so. <laughs> we are literally uh, showing are our age here, but you know. Listen, we're talking about music videos. These are our TikToks. <laughs> That's music right. Videos, you know? And if you're listening for the first time, I got to say, welcome. Hi. Uh, hi, it's Podcast Kill the Video Star. Y'all get to vote which one of our three music videos goes forward by liking the Instagram <gasps> post that corresponds to it. That's fun? right. See, the way that this podcast works, it's quite simple. Mono has a music video that he wants to present to us the co-host Lelon has one I have one we will then determine which one of the three moves on to the top 100 music videos list of all time this is the definitive top 100 best music videos of all time but we don't get to decide which ones no. make it y'all do all you have to do is go on Instagram at podcast killed the video star and vote Ooh. for which corresponding video is your fave the one with the most votes gets to move on to the top 100 music video we have like 50 already up in there, or just about yeah. 50. Wow. So we have to rank in them soon. We got to rank them soon. Yes, absolutely. But uh, yeah, so we got some good. I know we got some good videos. I know Leland's got a great music video that yes. I can't wait to talk about because I I got a little sneak peek of it, and this is one of my favorite music videos of all time. Oh. Leland, oh. I'm so glad you picked this. So tell us about your pick. Okay, so my pick is the Chemical Brothers Let Forever Be music video. Um, I first saw this on TRL, Total Request wow. Live. Amazing. Um, and it's funny because it was on for like a day. You know how like it's, it's yeah. Like, yeah. Like, like, right? Like, so like, um, right. and it blew my mind. I had never seen anything by Michelle Gondry. Right. Like, um, I wasn't even like a, like a huge chemical brothers, like fan. Like I sure I knew who they were, you know? Um, and you know, and I was also, and, and this was like right around the time where I was starting to like develop a personality of my own instead of just yeah. being like held hostage to like whatever <laughs> cooler kid, kid said. Um, right. And, you know, like, what was going on at TR all the time? It was, like, Limp Bizkit's Nookie. Absolutely. Um, Backstreet Boys, I'm sure, mm -hmm. you know. Probably I um, Want It That Way. Mm -hmm. I Want It oh, That Way, you know, like. The tyranny of that video. The tyranny. Um, and, and, and so, and then this comes on, and I'm like, what what is Limp Bizkit doing? Like, this is art. <laughs> like, this yeah. is art. Yeah. And it blew my mind. And it's the only time ever I called in to vote for a video. What? Whoa, and you voted for this I one? And I voted for this wow. one. And it's because I was not a voter. I wasn't part of it. Like, a big part of, like, I, wa I consumed media, but I wasn't, like, a fangirl. You didn't, I didn't, I wasn't. Yeah, you weren't a participator. Was not a participant. Yeah. Um, but, like, this one moved me so much. I was, like... People should be watching this video. I have yeah. to make my voice heard by it's dial incredible. tone vote. <laughs> um, and then I eagerly watched the lineup the next day on TRL to be like, surely America Please. saw 
what I saw in this beauteous like work of art and it just wasn't even on it. Didn't even rank. Oh, <laughs> like, I hate that. Brutal. Those, those like, ones are like my favorites too. When they're like the ones that like appear and disappear. And disappear like those yeah. are the good ones. That might those have been the, good ones. the first moment where I started to lose faith in this country. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In the yeah. democratic process as they I was when like, you realize you that stupid like, fools. <laughs> yeah. But when you realize that just like liking good things is futile or like liking things that are interesting and specific and special like means you're you'll always like things that aren't that popular (laughs) i guess so yeah it was really a profound moment for me i think like i really thought that more people were like me where more people were wowed right on their sofa you know like coming home from school and being like oh my gosh what did i just see and i thought everyone was turning to their phones and calling it like i was no no they just want to see fucking nick carter go am i sexual well i wanted to say that too but (laughs) not as much as i i wasn't moved by it you know (laughs) and i didn't want to see limp biscuit's nookie ever again Mm -hmm. and then i think limp biscuit had another one that like topped the charts which was the exact same movie like probably it was, was it probably like faith. faith. It was probably faith. faith. You yeah. know what? I think it was faith. It yeah. was faith. Um, I was so tired of faith. It was not a song that they did. And, yeah. and I was like so irritated. Like, because both of their videos Gross. were the same of just like somebody holding a camera and like Fred Durst going, eh, you know, like, and I was like, I hate this. I know. <laughs> no no I offense know. to him. I'm sure he's fine. Um, he's ger- he, you know, he directs commercials now, so he's thriving. At the great. Moment. Great. Yeah. We love it. Oh, my God. Um, that's great. And a movie. We'll talk. He did a really bad movie with John Travolta. Um, a famously bad movie where John Travolta plays someone on the spectrum. Oh, no. And it's very disrespectful. Oh, no. So, yeah, mm. it's bad. Wow. Oh, my God. It's not good. Wow, wow, wow. Well, if you want to see something that's a true nightmare, watch that. But right now we can't watch <laughs> Nightmares. Because we have to watch this dream of a music video, right? And, I mean, em- emphasis on the word dream, too, because this is... It's dreamy. We'll see. It's dreamy. A it's fever dreamy. dream? Yeah. Well, here we go. I'm going to say three, two, one, play, and we'll hit play at the same time. Yes. Okay, wonderful. Okay. Three, two, one, play. Wow. So we've got a little bit of a very trippy home video vibe going on. Yeah, I would say this is a very, this is like classic mid to late 90s aesthetic. Like yeah. the, vi- the video quality of this is. And also a very Michelle Gondry aesthetic as well. Who's no stranger oh. to the podcast. He's been here a couple of times. No. You're kidding me. Well, oh, this is yeah. his we, video, right? He directed this. Is, yeah, he directed. Absolutely. Direct, yeah. He directed a bunch of incredible say, videos. Yeah. I think this might be his most popular one. This one? Or like... No. You think the other I ones? Think, yeah, I, mean, I think Everlong is is his biggest one. Oh, or okay. ar- Around the World is his most famous one. Michelle Gondry directed Everlong? Yeah. yeah. I have never yeah. seen the music video of Everlong. What? See, I think oh, of... you got to, Lila. It's great. Oh. You you have to. It's insane. Oh, my goodness. I okay, mean, now what we is got... to love here? I mean, this is incredible. No. We got dancers that look similar, and they're all supposed to be our... Our heroine as she's running to the mall to work. Well, I it's believe. a lot of like 2D to 3D kaleidoscope yes, yes. images. Yep. And then it's also a lot of like manipulation of flat images and then making that real. Like, yep. like, like you're saying, jump cutting to make what looks like images stacked on each other actually happening in real life. Like, I mean it when I say this should be playing at MoMA. I mean, yeah, I totally agree. Right? Totally and then agree. and it didn't yeah. even make TRL's top 10 <laughs> for more than one day. <laughs> so upsetting to me. <laughs> it's also one of those ideas that's so so genius and so exhausting. Ex- exhausting. Emphasis on that exhausting, word for sure. Exhausting. Yes. Where you're like, guys, I know this is genius, but my God, when, how did you sleep? Like, I don't get it, you know? <laughs> this is like, so cool. And listen... The choreography is out of this world. It is yeah. impressive, impeccable choreography in this music video. And also, yeah. like, the lead is a good actress. She's a great dancer, and there's six of yeah. her. And yeah. also, like, yeah. like there, there's something very, like, 
like just like a watchable natural essence about her. Absolutely. Yes. And she does um, feel like the '90s it girl, like late night, like a Run Lola Run. Yes. Sort of. yes. yes. Run Lola Run. Uh, what's single white female? Sixpence none the richer. Yes. 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 yes you yes, know yes, that yes. kind of vibe. Very that. Um, Very so that, I married an axe murderer. Yeah. That, 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 that like yes. what? What is this? It's it's is it a pixie cut? She's yeah, it's wearing, a pixie, pixie cut. Yeah. It's a pixie cut. You know this kind of like. It's 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 at a time where redheads were the most exotic thing that was on they TV. Really, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when redheads were included in as diverse. This is my favorite yeah. shot where she's getting her nails painted, but her head is the size the of a big, giant balloon. Yeah. It's awesome. It looks like a South Park cartoon moment. Yes. Right? Just and Mono, this is your first time seeing it in general, right? Have I have this? seen this. Okay. I have seen this. Um, Honestly, what's so funny about this, this is, is that I, I knew uh, that is, this is insane. The kaleidoscoping, yeah, but is real life. Unbelievable. I know this video more so than the song. Does that make yeah, sense? Yeah, like, yeah. Wow. Like, I just know the video and I, I, I forget that it's Chemical Brothers. I'm like, oh, yeah, it's the video. Incredible. Gigantic clock. She's scared. Like the, like it's interesting. It's beautiful. And also there's a story. Yeah. Like yes. there's so much to love about it. It's oh. a Groundhog's Day, Ian, it's if you will. Perfect. Yes. It's perfect. It's so good. Wow. Well, that okay. was good to watch it again. So, Mono, wow. after watching this video, tell me, what is this video about? What's the story here? Schwauza. I mean, this to me is the story of a Groundhog's Day. Uh, a Groundhog's Day moment. This young lady really hates her job at the makeup counter. And can you blame her? Can you blame her? It has made her go mad. So mad that she has dreams about <laughs> uh, a, a chorus line style girl of hers that uh, shimmy about. And her only respite is the few minutes of sleep she gets every night. Wow. How'd I do? Were you reading That's that good. from the back of a DVD set or something? Like, <laughs> it felt you bring the word respite. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just really good at bullshitting. No, really I think good. I think you're right. I think there's good. I think there's an added element of her working at in the makeup counter, but also dreaming of being a dancer. Yes, yes, Ooh, 100%. Do you know what I mean? So then, fun. in her dreams, yeah, yeah. she's having that release of like being this like maybe a Broadway dancer, but like mm. that sense of like movement to then wake up to the reality of like movement, but in a very different way, like purposely running from A to B showing That's up late right. and then You're in right, the dreams moving in, the, in a more uh choreographed manner because in the dream she's in a sequined version of the outfit that she exactly. wears exactly oh. yeah mm. wow i'm getting wow. i'm getting a lot of layers right now yeah and yeah, then we're, we're and really then the it. the dream life and the reality life starts mixing together and uh yeah, she, and she can't escape it. That's why at the end with the big clock, Ooh. she's like, I don't want to wake up, but it's like the reality is looming. It's like, ugh, time to Ooh. time to do the whole makeup shit again, the thing that you don't yeah. want to do. And she's time like, I want to stay in my dreams. You, you know? Right, well, when you hate, when, you know, and look, we've all been there. I don't, whatever you're uh, doing, if it's absolutely. a job, it's school, where time feels like that, like it's suffocating. Yes, yes. And there's like a, yeah, wow. I, I Like, it's funny because I'm just like, oh, I just remember it being so beautiful, but like, I've never really dissected it, you know? Oh, yeah. And but it's, I mean, also, it's beautiful as well, you know? It's like. Yes. But I'm like noticing things now, like the thing with the big head, like, and the big head like remains at the makeup counter and then it shrinks, you know? Is like, yeah. and is that like a commentary on like, oh, sh her ego is allowed to get really big in her dreams, but then it has to like shrink at work. You well, know? she's like, being humbled. She's being humbled by reality, you know? Yes. Yeah. Damn. Wow. And then, Very and then she wakes up that last big clock shot is right. like, right. girl, you out of time. Yeah. That's upsetting. Enough dreaming. Time to, time to wow. live life. Yeah. And also and in her dream, there's so many of her. She's, she's capable of anything. Yeah. But in reality, true. There's only one. Right. That sucks. And also, there there's a there's a B line plot of a B plot of the homeless man of the uh, uh, unhoused man uh, becoming a drummer in his dream. So wow. then you have that. You know. So it's wow. it's about the power of dreams and the smashing disappointment of reality.
Yeah, Leland, I that music video, for Gaggy. lack of a better word, slaps. Slaps <laughs> so hard that I need to take a little break. I need to take a, me a little dream nap. And when we come back, we're going to talk more music videos. So we'll be right back. Okay. Oh, I'm relaxed. Yeah. I'm <laughs> oh, I love that break. Wow. That break okay. was... Did you guys have good good dreams? Mm-hmm. Or scary so nightmares? Good. Oh, my God. Well, uh, I have a lot of dreams. I had a weird dream last night. Well, you did? I, just weird. Like, and I'll, I'll tell you what. The one thing I remember was that, like, I was sleeping at a hotel, but the hotel was open air, and it was next to a walk-up McDonald's stand. What? It was so weird. It's, it was... It's, it's like that 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 strange thing where like your dreams like are kind of just like half ass creative, you know? Like we're yes, we're, yes. We're just like, oh yeah, it's kind of wacky, but not like stellar, blow your mind. It's like should we just exactly we just changed a few details and slapped it on the the old screen. Yeah, it's just like a bit of a brain scramble, you know what I mean? It's just like weird details from your life. I recently had a dream. I had a dream on Halloween that I went to a Halloween party with a bunch of comedy people and I dressed up as Morticia Adams <laughs> and I brought a super soaker and I put like um, like Nickelodeon slime on it and slimed everyone. Wow. Oscar, okay, again, this is so creative. sweet. This is, <laughs> this is so sweet. <laughs> And and what what did you, did you dress up as Morticia Adams for Halloween? What did you I do? I didn't dress up at all. <laughs> you clearly wanted to though. I guess I wanted, there was wanted an Oscar to. Inside yeah, that wanted yeah. to. <laughs> oh my god. Well, well, let's keep the dream going. Let's keep watching our music absolutely, videos. Who should go absolutely. next, Oscar? I think I'm going next. Great. Um, I am going next. I'm going to send you the link of the music video. Yes, please uh, let us know. And as you do that, ch talk to us. Okay, what so made you want to watch this? You know, this is it's crazy because it is in theme with okay. Leland's video. Wow. Okay. And, and, what, a, and what is the theme? In a very obvious way. Well, I have picked the Eurythmics Sweet Dreams are wow. made of this. Oh my goodness. We going way back to the 80s. This is pre-TRL. This is exciting. And I'm paying homage to the legends of the music video genre. Miss Annie Lennox. Wow, wow, Miss wow. Annie Lennox, Mr. Dave Stewart. I wow. am very excited to talk about this music video. This I've been is exciting. To, this has been on my list forever. Uh, it is, the song is slapped. The, the music video is really strange and very 80s to me in like a delicious way where it's, everything is abstract and sort of kind of maybe doesn't make sense, but it still looks cool. <laughs> Amazing. So, okay. I, I'm excited. Have you guys seen this video before? No, yes. I don't think so. Okay. I definitely, I have, and it's just like, I don't know. I think this is one of my, er, like, it's an early memory, but I also even remember in the 90s people being like, don't forget about this music video because, I mean, the song, the song I mean, is the insane. the song is great. The my, song is yeah. great. my mind is already blown. I didn't know it was called Are Made of This. I thought it was uh, these. Oh yeah. Oh. I, I, I too see. remember this. Like when I sing it, I always say these. I've I never known these. it was this. Yeah. Are made, are of, made these. of these. Who oh, am I are made of this. To... Yeah. 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 Disagree. Because she rhymes with gree. Disagree. Is it just the British thing? Is it just the Sagrees. made of these? these? Is that what it is? That's not how British people say this. <laughs> Um, excuse me. I'm trying. Is it these? May I try or these? That? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not a Brit, so I cannot say. Uh, excuse me. What is these? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, shall we? Dialect. Watch? Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's do it. Watch Ready? It. I'm gonna start the countdown in three, two, one. Play. I mean, it right starts out with of the a big gate. old. Fi I love it. The okay. shadow work here. Ah, crazy. Oh my god. I mean, look at her. You wanna uh. also. I look mean, at her, look at her, look at her. You also want to talk about the synthesizer. I oh, mean, absolutely. this. The sound of the 80s. This yes, is the sound of the 80s. Very iconic. Man, I can't believe I haven't. I've only seen this clips of this video from That's What I Call 80s, like CD <laughs> commercials. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So iconic. <laughs> the clip shows. This is insane. And can I say, this is one of the 
Gosh, you best. Look so amazing. This is one of the best beats in music history. Absolutely. Like Absolutely. It, it just drops and you're like, oh my god, this is insane. Ah. Oh. Like, how cool are these people? I wanted to be these people so freaking What are bad. they doing? They're meditating. meditating. On and like a, a, a table with records. But it's like a record executive table. So in a way, right. it's like a weirdly meta commentary yes. on, on their careers. So well, yeah, because, yeah, yeah, like this meta um, element where like, where the stuff we just watched, now we see it in a smaller screen with the typewriter. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Uh-huh. Are we triggered by the dot? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> this is like very We were, but now it's a green speak. screen. Uh, <laughs> so it's okay. Uh, don't, oh. Annie, stay away from the oh. bendy. Now we uh, got cows. Now we got cows. Hmm. What's happening? I will say she's a gender queer icon because this look would, wouldn't look good on 99% of humans. But I don't she know. Looks, you, I mean, she's Maybe you're right. <laughs> I, I, but she looks so good in it. She just looks incredible. Yeah. But, but if oh, you went shadows, into a salon. The lighting, the everything. The cow. cow. Unbelievable. I mean, the beat, the beauty is here. <laughs> yeah, it's and I it's mean, so it's confident. This video is so confident. Like, oh it's, <laughs> wow, that man in sunglasses just stared at that cow's eye. Shoot. Yeah. <laughs> Not the cow eye fucking us. Not the cow trying to be like. Uh, and now she's with the cows. Oh, yeah. Now They're the now in the cow's eggs, home base, the yeah. which is probably a lot more relaxing for the cows to shoot than like one cow. Imagine if you were exactly. that cow, like being led into like a, a record studio. What? You would be freaked out as that cow. You'd be like, there's no cut I can eat. <laughs> Why? This and is I, wild. Like. <laughs> Lilon, because also, what the fuck is being said here? I, I can't make heads or tails of it, but I love it. Yeah, I feel like I, I feel like definitely something's being said, but I'm not smart enough to, Ooh. to crack it. Or maybe, or maybe nothing is being said. Maybe you know I mean? it's something about people in the music industry are cattle. Like, that's kind of yes. what it is. Yeah, they're on a tiny little rowboat. We can figure this out. We can figure this out. <laughs> and there is one right answer. There is one. And thankfully, oh, we'll be asking. Oh, wow. oh my God. Oh, wait. Oh, she, sweet oh, dreams. She's reading the book. Sweet dreams are made of this. Was it another dream? Oh, it was another dream. It was a dream. Was it oh, another oh. dream? Yeah. And that nice bird's Whoa. eye. We love a bird's eye shot of someone in a bed reaching for an alarm clock or the wow. nightstand. Wow. Wow. Yeah, that was this very special. similar. Very similar to the Chemicals Brother video. Yeah. The shot of the, the girl getting up from bed. Yeah. Wow. wow. Okay, Lilon, let's dissect this music video. What the heck is happening here? Okay. Yeah, we're going to ask you, Lilon, what the hell is this about? So, Annie Lennox, queen. Uh, it, she, she, there's like also like, she's got like a ringmaster vibe yes. to her. She's like smacking this baton. There's It's a little, it's a little like dominatrixy. It's a little. Yes. It's very. Absolutely. It, um, and so she's telling you like it is. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me, th let me think here. Uh, <laughs> and so she, she's. We also accept very wrong answers. Oh, Absolutely. good. Very good. Cause get ready to accept. Um, <laughs> like, uh, so she's, she's the master of her domain um, in this record studio, but, she, and, and she always, she's always looking at you like, guess what? Bet she didn't know. Booyah. Got you. Um, <laughs> and, um, and and uh, what what other images we have? We have like her video being edited. We've got uh -huh. her spinning a globe. So it's like she like she looks like she knows what she's doing. She will not be manipulated. She's got this vibe that she invited that cow in there. You yes. know, she was she's like that's control. like like we don't really see a shot of her hanging out with a cow. I think at the same time, you know, it's just no. her and. What, Dave Stewart, I guess, is the guy Dave, with the sunglasses. Yeah. Um, but like we get the sense it's like that's Annie's cow. You right. know, like she, she, this, the, everything feels like purposeful, and um, just when you think you're worried about a cow being in a record studio, boom, we're in a field, and now she's like, <laughs> "Guess what? We're all just cows out here." <laughs> <laughs> I mean, honestly, I don't think you're wrong. I think that idea of like we're all cows, we're all like 
cattle. Yeah. We like, don't count. You know what I mean? We're yeah. recording artists, but like we're trying to sell records. It's the commercialization versus the artistry. And uh -huh. I think this music video like speaks to that. I think there's a there's a rebellion in Annie Lennox while yes. also quote unquote playing the rules, you know? Yeah. Yes. It's very cool. Okay, because yeah, let's think about the lyrics for a second. I, you know, I take these lyrics for granted all the time because like you know, when the this song like comes on, you know, at You're just dancing like, to the beat. Night, I'm like, yeah, who yeah. am I to you know, well, you um know, but but I yeah. have insider tea. I have insider oh. tea. I just found song facts. Uh, that you in, love your song facts. Annie Lennox <laughs> said that the song was written by the duo just after they had a bitter fight oh. and they thought it was the end of the road and that it was about to end. They were trying to write. She was miserable and they were just like, let's just do this anyway. And Dave came up with the beat and Annie Lennox improvised the synthesizer riff. And then they were like, oh, fuck, this, this is, is going to be a hit. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. So they came up with the music before the lyrics? I guess. Yeah. I, I guess so. That's really interesting. Yeah. I like knowing how songs are made, you know, just because I don't really have a brain for it. Same. But, okay. So, like, that's kind of a, oh, that's cool. That's a good song fact. You know, like, yeah. so we look at these lyrics. Some of them want to use you. Someone want to get used by you. Someone want to mm -hmm. abuse you. Someone want to mm -hmm. be abused. You know? Mm -hmm. um, everybody's looking for something. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. And then uh -huh. there's this whole hold your head up, keep moving on. You know? This keep is your interesting. Head up. You know, right, it's, it's, right. a, it's a cattle feel, right? Yeah. You know, it's, it's yeah, like yeah, yeah. A dog eat dog, you know, you're going to get lost right. in the sea. The, you know, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, a, yeah, it's, yeah, it, yeah. It's like, it's like, I think what the song and the video is telling us, it's like, listen, you're an artist. You're creating these sweet dreams, you know, but honestly, sweet dreams are made of this or these, these. which is these, these cows. which is. The business side of it, the marketing side of it, the uh -huh. consumer side of it, the capitalist side of it. Ooh, and that good. part is not not as cute as your little dreams. So I like this. Keep having your dreams. Keep moving on. Hold your head up. But baby, the fact is we're all cows. And Can we I, got I, Dominatrix I... record executives <laughs> beating, beating our asses. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say I also love that this song is so good. It doesn't matter. Like, and that is rare that a song is so good that you don't even, you're like, I don't care what's going on. I'm like, mm -hmm. like an animal, I like have to hear this song. And I don't even know what this is about. Oh, I think I'm that way about most songs. <laughs> Maybe yeah. all songs. Maybe all yeah, yeah, yeah. songs. Yeah. Like, Same. Same. Well, when I it mean, has a good beat, it's like, who really cares what the song's about? You know, who cares? obviously been sampled and covered so much. This song. Oh, yeah. I mean, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, uh, when the, the beat's Maryland that Manson, sick. The Nas. I'm going to cover this song. I'm going to learn. Yeah. Everlong. Yeah. Really long. After ever long. I'm going to get yeah. on the old acoustic. <laughs> I got to say for me, the moment in this music video yeah, is it's. It's it's just the bright red head staring right down the barrel. Like mm -hmm. bright mm -hmm. red headed gender fuck down the barrel. I love it. Yeah. For me, it is uh, Dave Stewart playing with the cow really being all up in his grill. That's <laughs> such an iconic moment. I remember that part when I think about the music video. Wow. I, I can't not. Uh, I'm with Mono. That's that's my moment. You know, it's mm -hmm. it's the moment where she has the baton in one hand and she smacks in another hand. Yeah. Like, yes. like straight down the barrel looking yes. at you like you feel like you've been smacked, you know, by. Her. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, like yeah. like she is like just that type of what's the word I'm looking for? Just like the assertiveness, that confidence, just being like, I got you, you know, mm -hmm. like it's like. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Yeah. <laughs> 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 It's fun. Hot, Exciting. Hot, hot. hot. Well, hot. that's it. Sweet dreams are made of this these, or these, uh, depending on what reality I you live in. I can't believe it. Dreams are made of these. these. <laughs> yes, just like all British people. Sweet <laughs> dreams are made of these. <laughs> Mono. Wow. Wow. <laughs> that was. Um, I was coming for the Brits. Okay. That, wow. Well, that was. A, that's, is he coming for the Brits? That was so far from a British accent. <laughs> right. He's coming for He's someone. He's coming for someone, yeah. We don't know <laughs> who. <laughs> Definitely coming for myself. Like. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Mono, it's your turn. Yes. What music video are you nominating Bitch. this week? 
I wanted to watch. I just I've been wanting to watch this. I it is very college me. It is just it is just pussy. It is choreography. I mean, it it is. It is fire, literally. <laughs> it is great. This is an early two thousands bop, um, <gasps> and uh, it's just good old fashioned music video fun. Just just fun. I don't know if Me- I'm familiar with the song or the music video. Oh, you I know mean, the song. You, I you bet you've the heard song. the song. Oh, yes. You know the song. Okay, well, we'll so see. what is the song? What's the so song, Mana? It's Buttons by the Pussycat Dolls. My goodness. Which is their best song ever. Um, what? This is okay. their best song. What's their best song? I mean, don't you? I think. Shut up. Oh, it's their best song. Right? No, Thank you, Leo. Yeah. no, no. Buttons is Buttons is fun, but don't you? Then how I come thought, I've, I how come I've heard of Doncha and I can sing it? Um, Ooh, like disagree. The whole thing verbatim, but uh, I've never heard. Disagree. Of this song. Period. Period. Disagree. Disagree. I be. I mean. Ooh. Ooh. Y'all can't take me. No. Y'all can't take me no. in my daytime makeup dress. <laughs> uh-uh. I've decided no. not to take you. Uh, <laughs> Okay, we thought well, about it, but we decided not to take you. <laughs> I am. Are you ready to watch the best Pussycat Dolls music okay, video? Okay, this better this better okay. be the best Pussycat it Dolls is. video. It absolutely is. Okay, and I'm very let's, see, in that. let's see. Right, let's okay, see. Okay. 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 We got it pulled up. We got our ads out of the way. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Three, two, one. Play. Oh, and we have Snoop Dogg too. Oh, mama, you look Amazing. <laughs> Snoop Dogg is, is <laughs> rapping yes. to Nicole, Nicole just like Scherzinger. walking towards Snoop is so funny. Yeah. It is sexy, it is horny. And is she like going to a boxing class later? What is this? Oh, uh, we, <laughs> we got the pussycat dolls strutting to screen. I didn't realize there were so many dolls in the Pussycat Dolls. There's there's like eight of them. Neither did Nicole, honestly. They're an interesting group, right? (laughs) Nicole has no clues. She's like, I don't know how many people are behind me. I don't know. (laughs) (laughs) Nicole keeps introducing herself to one of them, and she's like, I've I've known you for eight years. (laughs) That's so funny. (laughs) They're dancing in a tube, flicking their hair. This is like so funny. Funny. It is oh, very yes. well because like the Pussycat Dolls originally started as like this like cabaret yes sort of, like in the Viper Room like a yeah in oh, the really? Viper Room yeah yes. that's cool trivia and, yes they were a cabaret and then they were like oh I think we can do music and they were like yeah okay let's try yeah. it oh yeah this is like very like pop six squish Cicero you right. know like this, this is exactly right. this right I mean the, and this video is giving me production of. I, tango. Thank you. At a, at a warehouse. Okay, Mono, you've moved from factory to warehouses now. Okay. I right love there. warehouses. Oh, and we got beads. Seeds. We got beads. Um, the, we got beads. a staple of yeah, uh, aunt, of every two thousands music video. You this can't say me. beaded curtains. Also right. a staple of I mean, everyone's dorm room and high school Using them bedroom. like silks. Using the, <laughs> that part too. <laughs> using them as silks. We got chairs. We got the bar like Fosse. Come on. Oh, yeah. There's oh so much Fosse in here. This is this is right? Fosse Verdon, by the way. Y'all see that series? Thank you. I did. I did. We know she's the, she's the she, real mastermind. She's, she's a real mastermind. Okay, Stimp Stomp. Okay. We got Snoop the serenading Snoop, them. The I do. I do love a confident strut in music videos. It That's just, true. It feels good. It's everything. You know, and, and also I'm gonna I know say, that I can't do this. I can't. I can't yes, strut you in can. heels. Yes, you can. Yes, you can do it. I can't it. even walk in heels. The last time I wore heels, I was like moving like a angry transformer that's system <laughs> malfunctioning. And so I was like, Ugh. you know, this is it's impressive to we, me. We're oh wait, getting this is a little like appropriation light. <laughs> yeah. Wait, I'm uh, uh, wait, I missed the appropriation. Where is it? Oh, it's, it's just like a, a little weird Bollywood sort of Oh, the the, the tune. Yeah. I have I have okay. my music on low. So, if you're paying attention, they're moving so fast that they're smoking and then boom, their vagina's <laughs> ignited in a ball of flame. 
There was fire. Yeah, this CGI yeah. fire is really special. Oh my God. <laughs> Come on, this choreography and angles is good. This camera, this this aerial camera, the chairography, it puts a uh, stronger tiny to shame. The glove! Oh! I love a glove so small. A half glove. It, you could lose it. The last I time I saw it. a half glove was um, in Corey Feldman's music video, essentially. Oh my god, Leela. <laughs> what? I'm so sorry in the I brought Corey it up. Corey Feldman? Are you saying? Corey Feldman makes music. Damn him. Damn him to Corey hell. Corey and the Angels, that. I believe. And the Angels. Wow. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Wow. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Yeah. So, Oscar, I believe you have not described. Oh, Lord. Okay. What can I say about this? What uh, was that music video about? Uh, okay. So, it's a warehouse. That yes. used to it's a, it used to be a factory, one of Mono's favorites, a uh, factory that does nothing. It closed down. It got turned into a warehouse slash performance Love space. Love it. Uh, I hate when a factory makes products. <laughs> <laughs> you really do. You really do. I hate it. Um, then uh, Snoop Dogg shows up to just practice, and then in walks <laughs> Nicole Sersinger being like, oh, am I? I know my Equinox boxing class was late. <laughs> Are you my instructor? And then he's like, "Was oh, late." Yeah, <laughs> yeah, she's yeah, she's late. Um, and then he's like, "I guess so." And then all of the girls from the boxing class show up, and then the boxing class turns into just like a sexy cabaret There's class. Na nary uh -huh. a boxing glove to be found. <laughs> no. Everyone's in heels. That was, I can't be safe. That was the intention. Yeah, that was the intention. <laughs> but then the girls were like, "Should we just start our own cabaret group like right now?" And then they like <laughs> do it, and that's and that's the birth of the Pussycat Dolls. Yeah, Amazing. no lies, no lies detected. Yeah. yeah, um, I mean, yeah, I uh, I gotta say I'm here for it. I like that it is a literal, it is a music. Oh God, it oh, is a girl. music video. It is um, it is just promised of dancing, yeah, sexiness. And then a cool a cool appearance by Snoop Dogg. You know what? I love this about you, Mono, is that, like, I feel like... You, you love that I'm basic. Yeah. <laughs> and, and Honestly, I mean, like, like, yeah. Like, I, like, you're able to appreciate, like, um, you know, just, like, popcorn for what popcorn is, you know? Thank it's you. It's tasty. And sometimes, like, like, and sometimes when it's popcorn is just really good, it can be dinner. Yeah. Thank you. I this this is, I know you mean this in just the sweetest way, but now I do feel like an adult eating a lollipop. Uh, <laughs> no, I just, like I think there's like it's it's the same reason why I'm so crazy about Bring It On to the movie. Thank you. The sequel. Like, Thank you. The sequel specifically. The sequel. Um, Love the sequel. it. Um, <laughs> like like there's something just so. Um, like delightfully campy about the whole thing yes. all the way through. Absolutely. You yes. know? And and like if you can really tap into it, it can be so satisfying. And I and <laughs> Mono, I see this in this in this Thank video. You. It's like it's just like Thank you're gonna put you. it on. You're gonna what are you gonna get? You're gonna get Snoop. You're gonna get like hot ladies dancing. Um, I also think writhing in a tube, you know, yes. strutting around, like doing that doing the whole leg pop like uh, move where they're sitting in chairs. The pussy yeah. pop. Oh yeah. You know, like a lot of great. shoulder breathing, a lot of hair lot flicking. Of yeah, like yeah. just yeah, these I head snaps. It. Like I'm sure at least one of these ladies had to go to like the like had to be treated for like. A and you know what? Nicole injury. would have never known. She, she would be like, oh. <laughs> she's still trying to, trying to figure out how many people are in. <laughs> she keeps losing count. Like, how many of us are there? She, like, <laughs> their tour bus is like Home Alone, where yeah, like, I, it's like, okay, and I think we got everybody. Let's go. And then like Mindy they, or whoever yeah. is like, Wait. you know, I don't know if there's a like Mindy in the. Like I do. The post cat dolls. Even whether there is or isn't, she calls a girl Mindy, <laughs> it, even though it's not her name. Right, right, right. <laughs> Uh, I also I can't. Okay, Mindy. <laughs> yeah. okay. I can't get over the fact that no matter who it is in the cast, she looks at them and goes, "Oh, oh my god!" <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. My god. She, She's constantly so startled by her own group. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, which is that's honestly how the Pussycat Doll started. It didn't used to be like a group. It was like you know what I'm saying. It was like this is the current cast of this production. It was like a rotating cast. Yes. Interesting. Yes. Yes. Wow, I never knew this about. Yeah. Them. Fun fact. Fun yeah. fact. And I also have to say, this is not an in defense, but I just just to give everyone context, I 
purchased this in, on iTunes, the video in college, because it was during my slutty college years where I was like so trying to live out my slut fantasies that I sought out very sexual media. I see. That's so this great. is I'm saying. Okay, so it's special. slut high yeah. rise up. Okay. That part. That it's part. It's sentimental. That part. To you. Is, is I'm going to play this for my grandchildren. Is slut, I, I feel like slut is now a word that I haven't heard around recently. And, and maybe it's a point where it's like, well, you haven't been hanging around like, mono. Very I know. Early. It's true. I know. What a bummer. But, but like, it feels kind of fun now. It doesn't feel like as vulgar. No, yes, exactly. No. I feel like as I, it used to feel. I do mean it in the very positive Amber Rose celebrate slut slut walk moment. I I uh, I think uh, yeah. So hopefully it, uh, everyone else does too. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So in most of the pictures I'm seeing of the Putsy Cat dolls, there's only five of them here. Um, That's weird. Except for it felt some like that have was... six. Okay. And it felt like there were like twelve of the music. Yeah, think... <laughs> right. It looked like there like... were fifty of them. Yeah. A new every girl like of every flavor just showed up on my screen. I mean, I wonder uh, if it's just because they're all dressed alike and it's like a monochromatic tone. And so it's, and yeah, there's so many yeah. like fast paced angles. I'm like, wait, is she her? Is, is her <laughs> she? Like, right. I don't know. <laughs> That's the fun of it. That's the yeah. fun of it. It's like a eyes wide shut party. Couldn't <laughs> couldn't tell one person apart from the other. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh my God. What do you think is the layu for you, Mano? What's what's the moment for you in this video? I'm going to say chairography. Um uh-huh. I said it before, I'll say it again. Kind of puts the stronger chairography to shame. Ooh. Uh, so it's uh, it's it's the chairography for me. What about you, Oscar? Uh, I think the beads, the beads. It, it's giving me a baby <laughs> one more time. Oh, oops, I did it again. Vibe. Okay. And the cover art, at least. It's like similar to that. It's that. It's and that. specifically the where she like lifts herself with the bead. I'm like, I've never seen right? that done ever. And that girl's got an imagination. She wants to work out all... This is a fucking Equinox, I'm telling you. (laughs) Uh, Leelon, what about you? Okay, um, I'm just scrolling through galleries of the Pussycat Dolls, by the way. Um, (laughs) uh, For me, the the most iconic moment of the music video was um, the scene in the tunnel um, where, like, like, it's like the... Like, so we, we've got Nicole in the front and everybody's in the tunnel around her, like writhing and hip, flipping their hair and like creating like this like tantric octopus of yes. tentacles uh-huh. of mm-hmm. humans, you know, and it's just like very sexy. Right. Mm-hmm. It's the squid game we want to see. <laughs> it's the squid game we want to see. Oh my gosh. It's squid game. Um, oh it's, my God. It's, but it's, it's just like, it just looks like a squid. Yeah. Um, I'll, yeah. I will also say honorable mention goes to, of course, where they're dancing so hard that it starts smoking. And then when they hit their hands on I the mean, floor, the I can't fire one, bursts. One of us didn't mention that. I mean, that's yeah, wild. I know. I know. That's It's true. pretty wild. I mean, look, there's too many good moments <laughs> in this iconic music video. You're right. You're it's right. Also, yeah, it's, it's also an Equinox commercial. Let's be real. To me. You know what? And the, and, okay. And so now this, I see one picture of the Pussycat Dolls where there's definitely one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. There's ten. Keep like, counting. Like, keep like, counting. They're the... so. <laughs> keep counting. Keep going. Like, well. Um, it's who madness. Knows? It's madness. <laughs> yeah. Um, it is the pussy yeah. Anyway. This is an Equinox ad. I Because I'm getting, now I'm getting pop-ups saying only, only $60 a month. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Hi, it's Mindy. What are the girls from the Pussycat Dolls? <laughs> if you like this music video, join Equinox. <laughs> um, okay, let's. Let's make a case for each of our music videos yeah. because, as we know, the listeners now get to vote for which one they think is the gaggiest Absolutely. and deserves to be part of the top 100. Mm-hmm. Oscar, yeah. would you like to make your argument for the Eurythmics Sweet yes. Dreams? Yes, Sweet Dreams. It's a classic 80s music video. Uh, you know I love it when I <clears throat> get to showcase an 80s music video. This one is a little somber, a little darker. The uh, Not enough credit is given to the lighting in this music video, which mm-hmm. increases the mood, that like weird sort of just like odd mood. Um, Annie Lennox is, as we all know, an icon, and we get to see her at her most iconic in mm-hmm. this music video. It's weird, It's and it's super 80s. It's, to me, I was going to say the winner, but to be honest, I have one video that I like, Better than my pick. Whoa! <gasps> and it's Lil- mine. Yeah, it's sure. mine. Yeah, sure, Leland. It's w- mine. Why don't you make a case for my favorite music video this week? Okay. Uh, yeah. 
here's the thing the chemical brothers let forever be music video um was absolutely looked over in such an unforgivable way when i was uh -huh. in high school and like ha like how is it that a music video can like reach through a screen and grab a high schooler like this to the point where she grabs her landline family phone and goes burr, 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 <laughs> and like makes her only vote ever you know and the fact that nobody else voted for it really did make me lose my faith in humanity so this is a time for uh -huh. your listeners to restore wow. my faith in humanity and recognize wow. music videos for so much more than what music videos are asked we ask of them which is just like sexy things but they can be art they can be stories they can reach into your soul and and, and scare you in a way where you feel like are you running out of time have you made the right choices with your life that's what a music that's the power of a music video and it's only something like let forever be that that harnesses that power yes vote for this video please i <laughs> wow. beg of you do not really disappoint me again america <laughs> <laughs> okay mana and your turn buttons is a music video about <laughs> naked women and fire <laughs> she mana's and gonna the crazy win thing is, that could win because it's not up to us. It's up to you, the listeners oh and the goodness. viewers on YouTube. Just simply go to Podcast Kill the Video Star on Instagram to vote for your favorite music video. Lelon, please. Thank you so much for being a guest on the podcast. Where can people follow you on social media? Yeah. Follow me on your friend at your friend Lelon on Instagram and Twitter. I don't have to update them regularly. I do a terrible job. And all is it now is just me trying out tricks at skate parks. Back <laughs> Perfect. Um, and I hope and I hope people watch them. <laughs> yes. Yes. I love it. Well, go go follow us everywhere. If you really love this pod, remember, we can watch your music video if you throw some coins at us. Absolutely. Just click anywhere in the podcast description, YouTube, wherever. And if you give us some coins, we have to watch your music video. If you don't have coins, guess what else you can do, Oscar? You can go to Apple Podcasts, leave a five-star review with your music video in the review. We will look at it. We might cover it in the podcast down the line. Who knows? We'll consider it. We already we already covered one of those. We have. So we have. And it was the only one we saw in the Apple podcast. Yeah. So but thank you for being. writing a review. But while you're writing a review, might as well just drop in a music video in there. Why not? Why make, not? Who cares? Make it work for you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, we hate to end on a sour note, Lelon, but um, we have horrible news. Oh. Yeah. The news um, is. Do you want? Do you want to say it at the same time? Count of three. Yes. Okay. Oh, no. One, One, two, two three. three. We, we killed, killed MTV. MTV. <gasps> it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bye. 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 bye.